I'm going to start with the primer. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, and I'm using a one that I picked up yesterday, actually. And it's from the Swedish brand, like I told you about many times, Isadora. It uh, says Protect Face Primer, SPF 30, and it's tinted. So let's see how this one works. I've never tried it before, so it's going to be exciting. And so I'm using this one from NYX Concealer, HD Concealer, Photogenic, blah blah blah. And I will just, uh, ah, I'm just going to do this because I'm lazy. Boom, boom, boom. And this one goes so good on my skin, for real. It's like, just blends in so well, uh, really nicely. So yeah, that's a good one and it covers quite a lot too. And I'm using a brush from Real Techniques. And it's called the Lux Crease, Crease, Crease Brush. Brush. Looks like this. And it's just fluffy. So I just work it in here. You know the drill. And yes, I put some earrings in while you were out. Well, I, well, I pa paused the camera. Um, whatever. So I'm going to use, like always, the Contour Kit. Uh, Kit Contour from Anastasia uh, Beverly Hills and uh, as always I am using this one in the middle because it's the most grayish brownish color and uh, that's what I want so I'm using a little brush called blush brush as well but it's from e.l.f. and it's little and I love it and it's perfect for a lot of things but lately I've been using it for contouring I don't do a lot of contour so I'm doing this right now I don't do a lot and I'm gonna go a little bit just next step anyways I just switched a uh, brush for this too now I'm using setting brush they're really one of my favorites so so usable from uh, real techniques and I'm using the highlight um, in uh, this um, the shimmery one. I do not want to put it on my forehead, uh, as you might understand. I do not need to highlight, but my thin, thin, my chin is uh, quite little, so I want to enhance it maybe a little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, I used to be somewhat allergic to shiny on the on here, but lately I am not at all. So. Blush time. I'm not going crazy with this. This is actually a palette, and it looks like this, and it's pretty old, and it doesn't look so fancy. I can tell what I can do right now. Smash hit. It's a Swedish one, and this uh -huh. one, and the more pink one. Maybe this or this. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm using a brow whiz uh, from Anastasia Beverly Hills and it's in the color taupe 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 you know and I'm just gonna take both of these up because I'm gonna use this to kind of brush my hair my brows the way I want it Next step for this brow, I'm going to use uh, um, 
Also from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Uh, and it's called Duo. No, Brow Powder Duo. I always say the opposite, like the other way around. And it's the same color taupe. So, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to make it look cute here because brows are for me tricky sometimes, especially now when I haven't like colored my eyebrows. So, yay! When I feel that it starts to be pretty here, mm, you know what? I'm gonna just make it a perhaps just From Nabla Cosmetics, and I think I'm going to use hmm, this one for sure. Uh, it's called Let's See Narciso. Well, I'm gonna double check. Yes, Narciso, and then uh, probably the dark brown over here, and that's called Camelot, and a little bit of um, rust, I would uh, think. Um, Maybe some red. I will see. And honestly, I'm not, I'm not sure which one I'm going to use. But I'm going to start with the primer. And I'm using, uh, since I'm kind of over all the whole the whole drama, I'm going to continue using my favorite eyeshadow primer from Lime Crime. You can use any one. Uh, preferably vegan, obviously. It's at least cruelty-free. If you ask me, that's what I recommend. I'm going to just start with the one of my favorite, and I really don't know what I'm gonna do, so let's just I'm gonna do something um, typical my everyday kind of look. So for the highlighting part of this spotlight thing, and I'm gonna use one from a palette I have. I don't think it exists anymore, and also barely even the color I'm gonna use exists anymore. And it's this one, because I used it too much. It's like the only one I, well, one of the few I actually like really use from this palette. It is amazing. And it's from the same brand as the, um, mm, the blush palette, smash it. I'm going with a uh, eye coal or whatever. This is actually eyeliner. I really lost all of my black, like, eye pencils. So I'm gonna use something that probably is not meant to be inside here. Is from this brand, Un, Un Natural Beauty, and I'm gonna go up here. And now I'm gonna go with the dark brown Camelot um, from the Nabla Cosmetics uh, palette, same as I've been using.
And we'll go with this brush and kind of blend it a little bit the dark brown in. Kind of bad that I'm showing you with this eye because this is the crying eye I told you about. Grand Volume Lash Styler, Fanned Out Effects. And you all know by now that I'm a fan, a big fan. Ha! Huh, talking about fan, fan out, huh? Anyways, uh, volume on my lashes. I'm all about the volume on my lashes. You know that, girls, and whatever else. Whew, it's so big and fat. Oh, oh, this will be a little bit tricky to do the first time in a video. Well, uh, and it looks like this. You can tell, like, there's the, like, things, things right here. And then, in this way, it's, like, no sticking out. It's, like, it's pretty weird. But, okay, let's see, so I don't really... So I'm thinking for once uh, using um, um well, oi. Uh, for once using um false lashes 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 false lashes lashes and I'm, I just got this from um, Ilure like uh, it's called exaggerate number hundred and forty three yeah. So, uh, you can tell they are pretty cool. And we'll see how they look on me because, you know, I'm, uh, first of all, I'm not an expert on this. Uh, my eyes just keep crying every time, pretty much. So, let's just keep our fingers crossed that the day really works this time. I'm almost done here and I was thinking purple lips but now my lashes and my eyes are like popping so much I will use shroom from Lime Crime again velveteen because it's uh, easy and it's cute and I like it So be sure to not miss anything you should subscribe to my channel and you should like this video if you liked it I think that will be nice to me so that will be nice and um, yeah I will just that's my dog walking around 
uh, I will see you in the next video. And hope you're having a good time and you enjoy this video with me.